Hey guys, I'm back and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to be doing a lip swatch and a review of the Mars Cosmetics Creamy Matte Lipsticks. Now, these are quite recently launched and they have come out with like 24 shades. However, I have picked out only 7 shades. So as always, you can check the description box below to see the shade names. And for foundation shade reference, I'm NC40 in MAC and in Maybelline, I'm 310 Sun Beige. Now, if you have not already, then do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it, notified whenever I upload. And now, let's jump right into the video. First and foremost, let's quickly go over with the product description. Now, it says that from a classy red lips to a deep grungy vibe, Mars Creamy Matte Lipstick comes in a wide variety of shades to suit every personality and mood that you have. A silky glide that settles into a matte finish for that soft feather touch look. Now, these are priced at 199 rupees for 3.5 grams of product. And like I mentioned before, they do offer a total of 24 shades. Now, they are currently available on their own website, on Nykaa and on Amazon as well. Oh, and while I was doing some research about the product, I stumbled across purple.com. The same product is available. However, it's not from Mars Cosmetics. I'll add a screenshot of it. It is so strange because it is the exact same outer packaging and inner packaging as well but it's called black like B-L-A-Q-U-E black and it's called black silky glide creamy matte lipstick same names same shade numbers outer packaging is the same and so is the inner packaging as well just that the brand is different and the price is more it's like 2.99 rupees which is very odd and strange but yeah if you guys know what that is about let me know so this is how the packaging looks like which is quite color coordinated and you have the ingredient list at the back along with all the other details and on top you have the shade name and number and on the inside the lipstick is sealed like you guys can see here and this is how the actual lipstick looks like and now let's finally move on to the lip swatches
let's quickly go over the formula the pros and the cons now firstly these do apply very creamy soft and buttery and it gives a full pigmentation like one swipe you get the full coverage which is great it's very light and comfortable on the lips like it doesn't feel like you're wearing any lipstick at all and also these do not dry out your lips now these are transfer proof like for example there is almost no transfer and this has been on my lips for the last like four hours uh, however when you initially apply them it does transfer very very little but it does initially immediately it does take some time to set another point i almost forgot to mention is that these do give like a nice blurring effect on your lips which i kind of like it's like that blotted blurring sort of an effect which is nice now coming to the longevity of these lipsticks they do last for a long time like maximum i think was six hours and then i had to eat however if you have a heavy meal it will completely come off and i will insert a video of how it looks like as you guys can see it does come off however if you do press your lips together it gives like a sheer coverage of the original color for the removal you can just use a wet wipe and it comes off pretty easily also i do actually like the packaging of these like the outer packaging as well because they kind of correlate to the shade names like this one is khubsurat kuchipudi yeah so this is kind of nice it's like they thought about it you know oh and last but not least i love the fact that these do not become grainy or texturized or anything of that sort after some time because that has happened with the other mask lipsticks so i'm glad that they have fixed it i guess so it is not grainy or textury when you press your lips together after a wipe now for the fii there's just one quick point and that is the fact that these do not have like a fragrance sort of smell it smells like a normal lipstick and which is not strong at all like once it is this close to your nose is when you can smell it but otherwise it doesn't have any scent or fragrance as such and finally for the cons there is just one point and that is the fact that there are zero arm swatches or any sort of swatches available online on their own website on nika or on uh, amazon as well now there is just like a computer generated sort of like a swatch of the color but i'm talking like a real actual proper swatch at least an arm swatch you know so if you are planning to buy it i will highly highly recommend is two things first thing is make sure you watch other youtube videos just to get an idea about how the shade would look like compare other swatches as well so that you can buy wisely second point is that these do retail for 199 however just today for example i found it on nika for like 185 when i bought it it was 175 on amazon it is 175 today and on their own website it is 159 which is much more cheaper so yeah just make sure that you buy it when the cost is less and uh, yeah overall in my personal opinion i do love and highly recommend these lipsticks because the quality is amazing the formula is great as well the shade range is very wide and the pricing for the quantity is also amazing so yeah so yeah this wraps up today's video you guys i hope you all enjoyed it if you did do not forget to hit subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it when whenever i upload as well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or request i will try and visit for you as well as follow me on my socials which is on instagram and on twitter as well so until the next time take care bye